it was just a bunch of blocks piled on one another. And they were, they were welded together with the uh, wind and, and, and snow. Over the weekend, outdoorsman Josh Baker and his family stumbled across this giant island floating in Lake Michigan, just outside the small town of Goodhart. Sunday, he decided to climb the jagged 15-foot ice mountain, and once he made it to the top, he noticed the structure was different on the other side. And then the windward side facing the lake was uh, almost sheer. It was pretty neat. So the side I just kind of scampered up was all jumbly. And then the opposite side was a sheer down to the water. Goodhart General Store owner Jim Sutherland says the site is not a new one, but he says it's been many years since he has seen one this big. And this year we've been fortunate enough to have cold weather, lots of wind, and it builds ice, as in ice caves, ice mountains, ice, big ice. He says Mother Nature has probably been building this ice island for around six to eight weeks. The wind combined with the movement of water vertically and horizontally will cause a whole undulation of the lake as it moves toward these mountains of ice. And that mountain of ice left Josh Baker with a camera full of memories and a unique sight to share with northern Michigan. I've never seen anything that was that concentrated. You know, you'll see blocks stacked on each other along the shoreline, but this was so tall, so huge. In Goodhart, Nathan Edwards, 7 and 4 News.